Hi everybody, today I would like to speak about uh, the Dalmau points 3304. 3304 are uh, three points Dalmau. Those three points are lying on the Lang channel. The first point, 3313, is called Ren Shi. And the second one, 3314, is called, um, is called uh, Di Shi. And the upper one is called Tian Shi, which is 3315. So the name of the point, Ren is human, D is earth and Tian is heaven. And the character for Shi means or a scholar or a soldier. And why is it a soldier? Because the lungs defend the heart. The lungs are lying on both sides of the heart. And those points are indicated for lung disorders lung issues um, so the location of the points there are two versions for the location the first point the lower part Ren which is 3313 some of you will find it far soon above lung 9 and some of the some of the books uh, write that the location is three tsun above lung nine. The second one is three tsun above 3313, which is the middle one, and the uh, proximal one is 3315, is located three tsun above the middle. So uh, when you choose, the location will differ according to the first one, if you locate it 4 tsun or 3 tsun above lung 9. Usually, I located 3 tsun. Most of the Taiwanese doctors locate the first one, Ren Shi, 3313, 3 tsun above lung 9. Uh, American teachers usually located 4 tsun above lung 9, so it depends. What about the indication? So the indication for uh, Dauma 3304, Ren Shi, Di Shi, and Tian Shi are for any lung disease, mainly for inflammatory uh, lung disease. And the symptoms can be cough. This is the most uh, common uh, Dauma points that I use for cough. The points affect the heart, the lung, and the kidneys. But most, mostly I use it for lung issues. It can be cough, it can be asthma, since the points, the function of the points are to disperse lung chi, okay? And to also facilitate and move the heart, the chi of the heart. So, for any chest issues, you can think of a chest oppression, a chest pain, a palpitation, and mostly asthma, bronchitis, and cough. Remember those last three indications. Uh, these are very common indications. Now, when we puncture, there's also a a very important thing to remember that the depth of the needle the needling is very important for lung issues you usually use superficial uh, needling okay meaning that you uh, puncture let's say half a soon till one soon if you want to influence heart then you should puncture more deeply inside about a tsun or about a tsun, about one tsun. And if you want to influence um, 
let's say, uh, kidney issues, you puncture a tsun and a half deep. So the layers and the depth of the needling is also important. What can we think about those points in any combination? How can we think about them? So for asthma, we can think about those uh, soldiers or scholars uh, uh, Daoma with Chongzi and Chongxian, which are 2201 and 2202, which are also located on the Lang Meridian, approximately near Lang 10, but small inside of the palm. You can, you can see a, a different uh, video that I did on those, uh, um, those points. Let's say a person has a cough and also has a throat pain. He has a runny nose. So you can also think of Dabai as a combination with uh, the scholars uh, points with uh, 33, 13, 14 and 15. Uh, so you can think of also uh, Dabai. Um, usually, also, uh, Sima points, Sima are located, Sima, the four horses points, are located on the thigh, which, is, which are also indicated for lung uh, problems, lung issue. How do we puncture those points? So as I said, I use three tsun, six tsun, and nine tsun above lung nine, okay? So I use the lung meridian, and I go and I look and I puncture 90 degrees three soon. And the other one would be about six soon above lung nine. And the proximal one would be nine soon above lung nine. Okay? If you want to influence lung meridian, you puncture, as I said, superficially. If you want to influence heart issues, you puncture more deep about it soon. So for lung issues, you puncture about half it soon. Okay? So those are the uh, scholars, or I would say also the name are the guard, human guard, earth guard, and heaven guard, or human scholar, earth scholar, and heaven scholars. Those are the points.